Baby Sperma has an unpopular opinion. I think Queen is an overrated band. Let me just start by saying I don't think overrated necessarily means bad. I just think that people overhype the band and just kind of um, overestimate how good they really were. Now, let me just start by saying I am a fan of Queen. Um, during the quarantine, the past couple of months, I've just been listening to their music. I listened to all their albums from start to finish, everything that they had in their discography. <laughs> Even that uh, Flash Gordon um, <laughs> soundtrack album, I listened to that too. Um, and um, yeah, I just want to talk about it. Now, I'll start off a few compliments. You know, Freddie Mercury, of course, great voice, amazing singer. One of the best uh, classic rock vocalists I can think of. Um, and also just a really creative band. Um, just great stuff. Um, I love how they just do multiple genres, just rockabilly, they, they stick their uh, toes in jazz music, opera music, uh, all that different stuff. And you know, they just sounded different from, you know, like the Led Zeppelins, the Who's, the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, the Thin Lizzy's. Like they sounded different from everyone else. And um, they got popular off of it. Um, so I can definitely respect that. They were trying new things. Now, let me just um, state my first reason why I think Queen is an overrated band. And that's because of Freddie Mercury. Um, I'll get back to Freddie Mercury, but I'll talk about his death. Now, um, I forgot who coined this phrase, but um, when, when uh, Freddie Mercury died, um, the band just got the death stimulus package. That's the phrase, the death stimulus package, where, you know, the member dies or the artist dies and their music just skyrockets. Um, people just listen to it just because, you know, the artist is dead and stuff. Um, that's partially why I think uh, Queen is an overrated band. If they were still, well, they are still around today. Um, if Freddie Mercury was still around today, I don't think Queen would be nearly as popular as people really hype it up to be today. Um, no disrespect to the band, of course, like I said, I am a fan. Um, so yeah, um, Freddie Mercury's death, I really do think influenced or impacted the, um, the band's um, success for today. Um, why people um, look to Queen as like the greatest band of all time. You know, they're the greatest band of all time because their lead singer died. Uh, I think that's a big reason. Um, another reason why I think the band is overrated is because of um, their guitarist, uh, Brian May. Um, let me just start, start by saying I do like Brian May's um, rhythm playing. It's really good. Um, Especially how he's able to like do so many different genres and stuff and so many writing. Um, he's a really diverse guitarist. I do like Brian May, um, but I think his solos are just kind of lackluster for me most of the time. Uh, Bodine Rhapsody, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. I do like the song, uh, I just can't pronounce the... <laughs> I've, I've just never been, never been able to pronounce the, the song name. It's too weird for me. Um, I think that was like the highlight of his guitar playing. Um, he has a handful of other songs, um, maybe I can think of, not, nothing really off the top of my head um, that um, I like or really stand out to me. It's like great guitar solos. Um, but most of the time, I just find that, like his guitar solos just kind of in one ear and out the other. Like they don't really, it's not really emotional or like really, you know, a uh, hype up solo. Um, this kind of mid solos, honestly, um, like his solo, or pff, I guess you could call it a solo. I think it more of an, of an outro. His uh, his outro to um to um we will rock you. Like yes, like that nice slow rocky tone where it just kind of creeps into the song and it just kind of bursts out and it, and he kind of like just fumbles his fingers a little bit. It's a cool tone, but the notes really just don't hit for me. Just kind of. It sounds really cool at first because of the tone, but when he starts playing, it's just like, no, oh, it's, it's, it's okay, I guess, it's passable. But I, I feel like with that tone and that song, he really could have done something really cool, but he just kind of fumbled um, on that part. Um, so um, yeah, I think Queen is an overrated band. Um, solos really aren't that impressive. Freddie Mercury's deaf. Also, I guess I have to talk about the elephant in the room. Uh, Freddie Mercury himself, like I said, a great singer, iconic classic rock um, singer, but I think Freddie Mercury, um, or at least his fans, really overhype how good he really was. Um, 
there are a lot of singers that are better than him, in my opinion. A lot of uh, opera singers. Um, Lucido Peroni. Um, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing his name. I do enjoy his opera music. I do enjoy his music. I just can't, I just can't pronounce his name. Um, he's a really good singer. I think he would smoke Freddie Mercury in a singing contest. I think Freddie Mercury would agree, too. Um, Roger Daltrey. Um, I think he's another really good singer. Another really good uh, rock and roll singer from The Who, who people overlook. I think he is a better singer than Freddie Mercury. Um, Ian, Ge Ian Gilling from um, Deep Purple, I think he is a better singer than Freddie Mercury. Um, no disrespect to Freddie, I just think that he's not the best singer. He, he's definitely top tier when it comes to rock and roll, but when it comes to music in general, I mean, you can argue it, but I don't think he's one of the greatest, but I don't think he's the greatest. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, you know, Queen fans, you can downvote the video, write hate comments, whatever. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I don't, I'm not really a real Queen fan. But um, I do enjoy Queen's music. I just think that they are overrated. And um, like I said, I listen to all their albums. I don't think they're the greatest band ever. Top 10, easily. But uh, I would say lower... T lower tier uh, I would I think the who are better than Led I think I think the who are better than Queen I think um, then Lizzie is better than Queen I think um, Rolling Stones are, are better than Queen in my opinion um, you could tell me I'm wrong you could tell me oh Rolling Stones they're boring uh, the the who they fell off after Keith Moon died uh, whatever just my opinion I think Queen is an overrated band um, like I said, still a fan. I just think they're a tad bit overrated, and people need to really do their research and just kind of see that they're not the greatest thing ever. 